So what I wanted to talk was a lot of basic stuff. And there's one slide I don't have in there, um, and I call it my 333 section. Every day I've done one thing for 30 years. And a manager by the name of Ike Lacefield, who hired me as a realtor 30 years ago, and this is not in your book, said, just do this every day. He said, make three phone calls and write three notes. And then in 1995, one email came along, I wrote three emails. So every morning I write three notes, and I send out three emails, and I make three phone calls. And I can't even begin to tell you how much business comes off of that. It's just people where I just thought of somebody. If I see an article in USA Today, you can click on forward by email and send it to Mary, because Mary, I just thought about you because of this article. We were just chatting about this the other day. Little things like that counts. So this section, the first part of what I'm talking about is old world stuff. And I'm kind of known as a techie guy, so it's weird that this is coming from me. So um, you know, start with the basics, a real estate sign. Uh, we have a reflective sign. So in Oregon in the wintertime, we're 1,100 miles north of you guys, you know, it gets dark at 5 o'clock in the afternoon and the sun doesn't get up till late in the morning. So when you're driving along at night, the signs reflect at night. Little things like that make a huge difference. Um, interesting study, according to the National Association of Realtors, or NAR, which actually stands for Not Always Right, <laughs> uh, 95% of buyers don't remember their realtor after five years in study, 95%. Guys, that means that we are doing a terrible job of, the, of going after the easiest business we can possibly get, which is the clients that we've already served. I was listening to Galen, was it Galen or Rick, talking earlier about orphan, I think it was, a, I don't know, one of those guys was talking about orphan clients. So basically, I sell somebody else's listing, and then I just throw that other person's information into my database and start marketing to them. And I remember the first time I did that. I didn't do it for about 10 years, and somebody said, you got to do it, you got to do it, you got to do it. So I went through all of the clients that basically had